Now that the months-long partisan wrangling has ended, the ruling and opposition parties are expected to put the restructuring bill up for a parliamentary vote on Wednesday. Our political correspondent Kim Young Ji outlines the specifics of the plan. The main sticking point between the two parties was the creation of a new science ministry that was a key part of President Park's government restructuring plan. Under the plan, all broadcasting policy oversight will be transferred from the Korea Communications Commission to the new ministry. The main opposition Democratic United Party objected to the move because it said that would hurt media neutrality. The party now says the compromise deal worked out between the two parties contains measures to keep the science ministry from abusing its power. All functions related to new media, such as cable television network operations and satellite TV, will be transferred to the science ministry. However, the science ministry must get the Korea Communications Commission's approval before he can exercise his power to license those channels and before any new laws or amendments to the broadcasting law are made. The Korea Communications Commission is made up of members recommended by both the ruling and opposition parties. Under the compromise plan, the new science ministry cannot issue licenses for new media if it does not get the green light from this organization. The president had also hoped to put the Nuclear Safety and Security Commission under the purview of the new science ministry. However, the ruling party has agreed to accept the DUP's request to place the body under the prime minister's office. Only the research and development of nuclear energy will be transferred to the new science ministry. The rival parties also managed to narrow their differences on other key issues. They agreed to expand the function of the small and medium business administration so as to strengthen its power to regulate corporate monopolies and promote antitrust laws. The DUP had hoped to turn the body into a new ministry, upgrading its status. Instead, the parties decided to keep the body as it is while giving the SMBA chief a seat in the cabinet. Kim Hyun-ji, Arirang News.